Good evening, and welcome to Otis Jerry's Creepypasta Crypt. In the mood for a tasty pasta to increase your adrenaline rush. Well, you've come to the right place. Pull up a chair, get some popcorn, put your feet up, and have a listen, if you dare. <laughs> The Golden Arm by Mark Twain Narrated by Otis Jiry Once upon a time, there was a Moses mean man, and he lived way out in the prairie, all alone by himself, seppin' he had a wife. And by and by, she died, and he took and toted her way out there in the prairie and buried her. Well, she had a golden arm, all solid gold from the shoulder down. He was powerful mean, powerful. And that night he couldn't sleep, cause he wanted that golden arm so bad. When it come midnight, he couldn't stand it no more. So he get up, he did, and took his lantern and shoved out the storm and dug her up and got the golden arm. Then he bent his head down, gin to win, and plowed and plowed and plowed through the snow. Then all of a sudden he stopped and say, My land was that! And he listened and listened, and the wind say, And then way back yonder, what the grave is, he hear a voice. He hear a voice all mix up in the wind. Can't hardly tell him, Pot. Who got my golden arm? Who got my golden arm? <laughs> and he begin to shiver and shake and say, Oh my, oh my land. And the wind blow the lantern out, and the snow and sleet blow in his face, and most choke him. And he started plowing knee-deep toward home, most dead. He's so scared, and pretty soon he hear the voice again. And it is coming after him. Oh, who got my golden arm? When he get to the pasture, he hear it again, close to now, and a coming, a coming back there in the dark in the storm. Oh, and when he get to the house, he rush upstairs and jump in the bed and cover up, head and ears, and lay there shivering and shaking. And then, well, there he hear it again. And a coming, and by and by he hear it's a coming upstairs. Then he hear the latch, and he know it's in the room. Then pretty soon he know it's a standing by the bed. Then he know it's a bending down over him, and he can't scarcely get his breath. Then, then, he seemed to feel something cold right down most again his head. Then the voice say, right at his ear, Who got my golden arm? You've got it. I hope you enjoyed this evening's tasty pasta. Until next time, sleep tight and be afraid. Very afraid. <laughs>